Okay. <sighs> We've been feeling a little bit trapped over the past few days. We haven't hiked in a long while. And so we thought today's the day. We're gonna go for a short, easy hike. Enjoy the beautiful weather that we have going on here. And we're very excited to show you around one of our favorite mountain ranges here in beautiful Arizona, Superstition Mountains. There's a lot of colors. I don't know where to go. See a lot of colors. Only feeling the trail that we chose today happens to be in a state park, actually and that is the Lost Dutchman State Park. There are so many beautiful hiking trails. We were just talking to the ranger. And they told us that they even have Facebook Lives every single week where the ranger would go, hike on the trail, show you around, give some information about the vegetation. And she was telling us about an annual camp out event for families and their kids, for, especially for people who've never gone camping. They would come in here, they host the event, the ranger would spend the night with them show them all of the basics and how to set camp and stuff like that and i thought it's such a an interesting event to have people really love it but obviously with the pandemic right now it's not uh, as easy to to host is alex jumping behind me of course he is of course you are i will kill you Well, actually, just behind us is a, a wedding ceremony that's wrapping up, which is really nice. This view looks so very beautiful. It's worth it to get married here. So just uh, a bit of information here about the trail as I'm waiting for my video of the sunset it's really beautiful in here i can't even believe we haven't done this hike before but anyway this trail is rated moderate on all trails it's 2.3 mile and the elevation gain is just around 530 feet i would say it's very well marked there are signs throughout the way uh, the views are obviously gorgeous. Anywhere you hike in the Superstition Mountains, you are in for a treat. So I can see this uh, trail being kids friendly. The only thing to keep in mind is that in this state park, the gates are closed by 8 p.m. So you just have to keep that in mind as you are planning. Make sure that you head out before they close the gates so that you're not stuck. Um, yeah, but other than that, very comfortable hike to be honest. Here is the sign, but that is the actual trail where you loop back. This is the end of the first leg. And again, this is a loop. So you'll have to, to continue on the, on the loop from here. <laughs> 